Hello and welcome to Analyzing All Sorts with E.T. Tutor. Today we're thinking about the connotations words have. So the things that people associate with words with, uh, the way certain words are symbolic, and trying to see what kind of effect that has on the reader. So here we have a smoothie drink made by a company called Innocent. So we're focusing in on that word innocent. What do we think of? One of the main things we think of when we think of innocence is children. Here we've got the uh, more colloquial kids. That's all part of the kind of relationship that's being built up between the product and the consumer. So that word innocent not only represents the target market, but it also has connotations with good, true, pure, all the things that we want from a fruit drink, especially if it's one for children. So if we uh, turn it over and have a little look, we can see that actually all it contains is fruit. So it is pure, it is innocent. And if you do have a look at the ingredients, the nutritional information, you can see that their claim is being backed up. All right then, I really hope that's helped. Just remember, words are everywhere and you don't always need to be in a, with a textbook to be revising for English. Just look around you and really have a, have a think about how words are operating. What are they doing? What are they trying to achieve? All right then, check out the other videos and like and subscribe.